Hey everybody, my name is Ryan Productions from Gaming Wilson. It's Twinkly Ten, and today I'm going to be talking about Sonic Forces. So this is pretty, well, it's incredibly late, but I'm a huge fan of the Sonic series. I started quite a while ago, like when I was actually don't even know, like 11. Okay, just to put it in perspective, I I started playing games when I was 10 because I wasn't allowed to play games before that. So that was, it was very soon. So I've played Sonic the Hedgehog One, Sonic the Hedgehog Two, Sonic the Hedgehog Three, Sonic and Knuckles. Sonic Adventure DX, Sonic Adventure 2, Sonic Heroes, Sonic Unleashed, Sonic Colors, and Sonic Generations. Uh, so the first four games, I really enjoyed those. The second one I found really hard. Uh, first one, I probably the one that I enjoyed the most. Oh no, Sonic CD as well, I forgot to say CD. CCD is so much fun. So I really like CD, really like... So my, my favorite from the time is probably... Free, One, and CD. Uh, then so there's Sonic Adventure DX and Heroes and Sonic Adventure 2. Sonic Adventure DX, I really like. Um, Sonic Adventure 2, I haven't played all of it, mainly because it was so long. Sonic, Sonic Adventure, Sonic Heroes, so fun, I really, really like it. Um, what else, what else, what else, what else? Okay, we got Sonic Unleashed, I, I liked it. But to be completely honest, like like the, the the daytime stages were really good in terms of the level design, but they were just I don't know. There was a, l a lot of glitches, and the Werehog stages were fun, but they're still they were still quite annoying. So I really like Unleashed Project on Generations. I'll say that much. Sonic Colors. What can I say? It's just it's a very it's a quite a good in innovation. The like the f third person 3D. Like, the, when he's boosting, that's pretty fun. Then the 2D platforming sections, those were also fun. A bit too much, but that was still good. Sonic Generations, probably my favorite Sonic game, like, overall, considering that it's got both. Uh, I really liked how they did Classic Sonic. It's not exactly the same as the other one, as, like, the, the originals, but it's still, it's a good um, homage to it. And they got the boost formula, or whatever it's called, Almost, co almost, com like completely true. I have installed. I don't know how many hours I've played on. I've got it for PC and Xbox 360. Got a ton of mods for it. I really, really enjoy it. So I loved. I really love Generations, and I'm really um excited for uh Forces because obviously every the reason people make people are the only people having prob problems with Sonic Heroes. One because they're adding classic Sonic, people are like oh. Oh, fuck him off. We don't, we don't want to know about Generations or something. I don't I don't know how you can hate Generations. Generations is a really good game. Um, What else? Oh, then there's also the character customization, and obviously there goes a creepy dead deviant art thing. It's like pregnant Sonic. What the f... Okay, I personally find that just retarded. Kind of weird. Uh, I don't I don't really judge. I just find... I just find that really weird. Uh, but I understand how you could imprint, like... How you could project your own ideas on Sonic, because he's quite a blank slate. Other than his personality, he's not, he's quite generic. So, that's, uh, it's, it's, that's quite easy. And that's actually been quite good for the modding community, because there's so much. Like, there's so, so, many, so many different skins. My personal favourite um, character is either Sonic or Scourge, because my favourite colour is ne Neon Green. And he's, he's just, just so cool. I just... I really like him. His supersonic form is so cool as well. It's really, I really, really like it. He's also he's also kind of more powerful than Sonic. It's it's complicated, but it's he's really really cool. So Sonic Forces looks good. I'm the graphics look incredible. I'm obviously going to get it for the PC and probably for the P PS4. Um, I'm like I, I cannot stress how excited I am for S Sonic Forces. I've been in, in and out of the series, first with the classic games, and then I got out, then a bit of with, like, the more modern ones, and then out, and then I got it back in with, like, when Generations and Colors, and then I've just been playing Generations ever since, and now I'm really excited for for Forces, so that's going to be so much fun. Um, what else? Oh, by the way, I didn't, when I said I was 11, obviously I didn't play them on the Dreamcast. I've got Adventure 2 on PC, Adventure DX on PC, Heroes on PC, Generations on PC, and 360, obviously. Unleash, I've played the Unleash project and on PS2 emulator. 
um, colors. I've played it on Dolphin, so that's really, it's so much fun. Um, and then the original games I've played on of his on em emulators and on iOS, so I've had a lot of fun with those. Um, so I'm really excited. I'm sort of scared for what people are gonna make. Thank God they can't do like pregnant Sonic shit. Like I'm I'm happy about that. But I think it looks really good. The graphics look stunning from what I've seen. The Green Hill Zone music, like you probably heard this a lot, but it's so I don't know, it's it, it hurts. Like it hurts to to listen to, so that's that's quite disappointing. Other than that though, I'm really excited for Heroes. It's gonna be quite good for the series. Classic Sonic and and Modern Sonic look very similar to what they were in Generations, which I think is good, but they look slightly more fine-tuned because some of the Generations part, like the cameras, oh damn, the cameras, sometimes they really screwed up. Um, but yeah, it's really, I'm re really, really excited. So I really hope that gets, I, I really hope the game is good. And then Sonic Mania is coming out, which, which I'm pretty sure, let me just check. Yeah, it's a completely new 2D sprite called. The graphics look really good. I really like light blue Sonic. He's awesome. So that that's really cool. So I'm excited for that. I'm happy that they delayed, they delayed it, so it's going to be a good game, not some rushed piece of shit. I really hope they don't rush here forces as well. So they could get in a they could get on a really good run. They had Unleashed, which was. It wasn't that good, like it was, it had some annoying stuff, but it was in the right direction. Colors definitely in the right direction. It's like too much platforming. Generations, again, really in the right direction, but still missing a few stuff, and hopefully this is, so we, we're really good for it. I just hope, the Sonic fan base is just some of the most retarded people on Earth. Like it's, oh, I hate it. Okay, so I really hope, you enjoyed this video. I'm incredibly excited for Forces. I hope you are too. Probably be getting like, pre-ordering some. I'll pr probably pre-order Forces, but this looks really good. I haven't been excited for a game in a long time, so I'm very excited for this. I really hope you enjoyed the video, and goodbye.